Hello, welcome to my bookshelf, and today, welcome my special guest, the Geek Gear Box, that I'm about to open and reveal to all of you. I'm so excited. This just came in the mail. Let's open it up. Oh my gosh. This is like an epic moment. That was fun. Oh my gosh. Okay. Magical. What's in it? I don't even know. Okay. Okay. There's a lot of things going on here. Let me set this down. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, this is clearly some kind of pencil pouch, if you remember back, back in the day when these were a thing. Okay. So, and this is Star Wars. Ah. See? Um... Oh, okay. I figured it out. It took me a second. This is a lightsaber. See? Jing. I can't make lightsaber noise. But yeah, this is supposed to be a lightsaber case. That's so cool. Exciting. Um, yeah. Now I have a pencil case. That's exciting. Um, yeah. Let's see what we all... Okay. This was in the middle here. Some kind of poster. I can get this out okay so this okay I'm not good at holding this stuff up yet okay this we don't know is Link in the Legend of Zelda series this is probably from the newest game which I'm Gonna be honest, I don't remember the name because I'm poor and I don't have the Wii U, so I can't. So I can't remember because I don't want to look up things that I can't own. Oh, that's really sad. But I do absolutely love Legend of Zelda and Link, and yeah, he's he's shooting he's shooting something. And I'm well, it doesn't really look like Epona, but it reminds me of Epona because that was his horse from Orcarina of Time. But that does not look like Epona. I mean, it's brown like Epona, but it's not designed quite the same way. Maybe it's still Epona. I don't know. Oh, this one's even better. Okay. To me, anyway. Look at that. Link is such a badass. He... Oh, my gosh. That is so cool. Um, but now, from your angle, it looks more like high def. But... It's more, it's it's more like you can see like the drawn lines. Like you, it, it almost looks like someone you know painted it or something. Like you can see the strokes. Um, but it is cool from far away. It looks more like, ooh, this is a photo of someone shooting you. You know, that's cool. It's really shiny too, as you can see. It's so shiny. All right, moving on. Oh. 3D Star Wars coasters. I'm really excited about this. Okay. Oh my gosh. There's eight of them. <laughs> there's eight of them. I was just thinking there were four, but there are eight. Oh my gosh. And the back says join the resistance, obviously. I'm going to see if these are all the same underneath or not. Oh, they're different. Oh my gosh. Okay, so first one, Kylo Ren. Badass, obviously. Um, this one's almost even better to me. I don't know if it's just because I'm actually looking at it from an angle. But Stormtroopers. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. For some reason, I doubted that we still call them Stormtroopers now that they're part of the First Order. But I, th I think so. I don't think they got a new name. Um, ooh. Now... This kind of reminds me of Captain Phasma, but I don't think it is. I'm not sure. There's a sweet cape, though. Maybe it is Captain Phasma. It's hard because I'm not hearing the voice, so I'm not really sure. But there's that sweet cape. And it does look metallic -y silver, so that's my guess. Oh, and, of course, Ray and BB-8. Sorry, BB-8. I mean, how cool is that? You probably can't tell that it's 3D, though, but it has that weird hologram effect, which probably doesn't work very well on camera. Okay, let me open the second package. Okay, so this first one 
Is the stormtrooper running at us? I mean, this could be Finn. Like, we don't know. Oh, it does say numbers on it. Mm, I can't read the numbers, but I don't think they're Finn's call numbers. So maybe not, but stormtrooper, still cool. Oh, sweet. Chewbacca. I'm not even going to attempt, but you know. You know. Chewbacca. And he's, like, in mid, like, you can tell that he's, like, war, like, yelling right now. It's amazing. Oh. Now, I'm sure these have a fancy name, but I don't really know. Obviously, there's some kind of stormtroopers, but they have, like, flamethrowers, which is pretty intense. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what their specific ones are. I know that they're snowtroopers. I don't know what these are. They're, like, flame troopers. I don't know, but don't want to mess with them. Oh, I love this. Okay, it's all the favorite droids. Oh my gosh. 3PO, RTD2, BBA, they're all just buddies hanging out. This is amazing. Well, moving on, there's more. That wasn't it. Um, okay. Let's see. It's a high roll pen and pen topper. That, by the way, is a pretty cool pen. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. Okay, moving on. Sure. I've been avoiding this, but might as well just embrace it. It's a t-shirt. Okay, what do we got? So, okay. I looked at this. I wasn't sure. Um, mainly, you know what's throwing me off is this symbol. Not sure what this symbol is. I'm assuming it's Elvish for something, and this is throwing everything off. But, on closer review, I've noticed that this is Lord of the Rings, which makes it even better. Because, okay, this is Gandalf, clearly. And then, oh gosh, this is hard. Okay. This, this, I think, are the three trolls from The Hobbit. And this is clearly Bilbo right here. Um... Uh, oh my gosh. This is clearly the Hobbit related because um, that's one of those creepy giant spiders. Um, that's probably that giant forest. And of course the dragon. The dragon. Um, yeah. You know, smog. Um, let's see. What do we got? What do we got? This is a whole adventure. This is cool. Those are those, this is clearly from the movie, because those are the Goblin King guys that are attacking on those giant, I don't even know what they're called, but, oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. And then there's the last little scene. And I'm not 100% sure what this scene is. I, I want to say that's Gollum. Um, but I could be wrong. But either way. Oh my gosh, this is really cool. That makes it so much better. I'm so happy. I originally thought it was Game of Thrones <laughs> until I looked closely. There's so much detail on it. I didn't realize. Oh, and of course, there's the eagles that need to help us all out. Oh my goodness. Okay. I love this. Oh my gosh. gosh. Okay, moving on. There's more stuff. Like... <laughs> Like, Assassin Creed, oh my gosh, my glare is ruining it. Assassin Creed vinyl stickers. Oh my gosh. This is cool. I mean, admittedly, they're stickers, so I have a hard time because I love stickers, but once you stick it, you can't unstick it, so you have to place it in a really good spot, and I don't, I never, it never seems like a good enough spot. Like, where am I supposed to be sticking these stickers? Um, but either way. Oh, it's a button of BB-8. Ah, that is so cute. Oh my gosh, I love buttons. Okay, I think this explains things, so I'm not gonna look at that. Um, okay. Oh, it's a cute little mini box here. This is, by the way, so exciting. I've known every single reference so far, even though one tricked me. Um, this has been really good. How do I open this? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, are you ready? Are you ready? No. See, I can't, I can't even do this right. Okay. What's inside? 
Ooh, it's even taped. Like, the detail that goes into this. Okay. Ah, oh, sweet! Assassin's Creed. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. And it's one of those ones that you can just slip on over. Bam! That is so cool. Alright. This feels like Christmas. Oh my goodness. Okay, I think there's one last thing in here. It's one last print. And this one is like stiff and straight. Um, I'm just going to call the horse Epona because I'm hoping that's who that is. And of course, I had to double check. Yeah, and that's Link on there. Though now he's rocking blue instead of green. Not sure what's up with that. Dang. But I love it. It's a cute print. Wow, okay. That's it. Oh my gosh. This is the best decision ever. I was really worried that I was going to get things that I didn't know the reference to or were kind of lame or not good quality or whatever. But my expectations were shattered and I'm so happy. This is so cool. I'm going to double check that I got everything right. The Hobbit t-shirt, yes. Um, oh, the new Zelda game is called Breath of the Wild, in case you're wondering. Ta-da! Aww. Apparently, one in every 100 gets a black version. And of course, I get the silver one. Wah, wah. Now it makes me sad because... I mean, now I want the unique one. I'm 99 out of 100. That's no fun. Ooh. Hmm. Okay, so I guess there were three different badges, and I got BB-8. I don't know. I really love BB-8, but, like, looking at these other ones, I kind of like the other ones better. The Death Star one's pretty epic. Um, and, of course, RTD2 because classic. I probably should hold it up better so you can see. But, I mean, I shouldn't be mad. BB-8 is the coolest. I think, honestly, the only thing I don't like about it is just that he's orange. And orange just isn't my color as much as blue. I love blue. It's so deep and beautiful. I mean, even printed on here, it looks epic. But that's okay. Okay, and if you're curious about next month... It's going to be Arcade Month! Yay! It's just really cool. Again, the detail that goes into this. February. It's adventure, in case you didn't know. Eek. I'm so excited. Um, so yeah. I did my first Geek Box. Well, I hope you've had fun watching me unbox this. Um... Yeah, I hope to see more of you, and I hope you see more of me, and until next time, see you later.